All right, guys, day two of the Zambia Files. We are off to our friend Gloria's house. We're gonna learn how to make some shima. Which is a traditional dish here we made with cornmeal and water. That's about it. Um, we met this <laughs> very family. Thick. Very thick. We met this family uh, during our homestay a few days ago. They're super sweet, super nice. And yeah, we're excited to have lunch with them. Anything to add? <laughs> um, so we were asked what kind of meat we would want with it, and our options were beef, chicken, and fish. And we've already had it with chicken, so I suggested maybe maybe fish or beef. But then um, on our walk, Grant reminded me that the fish are actually like dried fish that are this big and have like, like eels. Yeah, and eels, and they have like flies like flying around them and don't smell very great. So I'm hoping she went with beef. Yeah. Yeah, we don't know. We'll see. We'll Pretty see good. how it goes. We're headed to the market now. Are you guys coming to the market with us? Yes. All right. Glory, you should introduce yourself to the video. Okay. I'm Gloria Matunge. Um, I'm the third born from a family of four. Yeah, I reside here in Zambezi. Um, I'm a mother of two. Yeah, I'm married to David Self. All right, and Gloria and David were nice enough to host us the other night. Mm -hmm. So we got to stay here, and um, they invited us back to make some shima and have lunch. Mm -hmm. It's awesome. Chopped up some rape. This is traditional uh, greens here in Zambia. Got some tomatoes. And then we've got the shima over here going. Hello. My name is Shekina. I don't know where they're taking my camera or what they're doing with it, but oh well. Hi. Wow, nice sun. A lot of people. Mama, look here. Good work. <laughs> Also doing it dry. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Wanna try and give it a couple stirs? High five. Thanks. Good work. That's how it's supposed to be done. That's the perfect technique. Look at this. It looks so easy. I know. You're very fast. Sure. <laughs> it's done. <laughs> Oh. Your shima is nice because usually if it's not done, then it will not like come out or fall off. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sauce, chicken. Beautiful shima. Thank you so much, Gloria. You're welcome. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Dance. Dance, Gunda. Look at that. Dance. Dance, Gunda. All right, we're back from making shima with uh, Gloria and her family. Uh, super great time. The people here are just so kind and generous and welcoming. Um, so, great afternoon. I'm not sure what the rest of the day has planned, but I'm sure it'll be good. I think we are going down to the river for sunset, so this video is going to continue right now.
We're about to get on some boats here and cross the river. Should be a good time. Are you excited? Yeah! yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Use that cord. Yeah. 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 <laughs> nice. I need to get out here and fish. I know, dude. <laughs> Joe, tell them about our fishing adventure. That's We're going to gonna go fishing and catch tiger fish. Yeah, Joe yeah. brought his pole all the way from Washington. <laughs> Sun's about gone. It means I'm not going to crank up my ISO anymore and make this nasty image any more grainy. That's a wrap That's on a wrap. the Zambia Files day two. See you guys later.